Here's a bug with the new saving and loading system in Gloomwood. If I open up the load game menu, we can see that all 10 of the available save slots have been filled. The one at the top slot 0 has actual progress made in it, and the others have just been filled with new games for the sake of this demonstration. The natural question to ask is, when the user gets into the state where all the slots are filled, what happens when they start a new game? Let's find out. New game. We have to wait about 10 seconds before the game is saved. I think that should be it. You can see here if I open up the load menu, it turns out that the new save file has been placed in slot 0 as the default behavior when all slots have been filled. The problem with this is that was the slot where I had a real save file with progress in it. So by starting a new game without any warning, my save my progress has been erased. A few different solutions for this. One is if the game is always going to save into slot 0 when the menu is full, just to put a warning message when starting a new game to alert the user that their progress is going to be erased and ask them to confirm before they start the new game. Slightly more expensive option is to provide a choice to the player. When they start a new game, when all 10 slots are filled, to ask them which slot they'd like to overwrite with their new save file. And a third option is to deny access, to say you can't start a new game when all of these are full, and ask the user to delete an existing save file before they start a new one. Any of these options should work fine for preventing players from inadvertently overwriting progress they've made.